Hi there, welcome to Kevy Shaves. Nice to see you. Nice to be back here in the bathroom shaving. Um, it's uh, it's evening here. The good thing about the summer is that it stays light. Um, we get the light here to maybe about half past nine, ten o'clock, then the sun kind of starts to fade away. It's not very sunny today, quite dull, quite... Yeah. It's June after all in Scotland, you know, so... Um, I hope the weather's better where you are um, and you're enjoying some um, nice shaves. Right, uh, a bit of a mixture of products for tonight's shave. Uh, some things I've used before, some things I haven't. No, there isn't anything I haven't used before, but um, some things I haven't used for a long, long time. So I just like kind of looking through uh, the soaps and stuff like that, and brushes, razors, and just saying, I haven't used that for a while. Let's try that again and uh, let's use that just because I want to use it. Actually, the soap, someone mentioned it in uh, one of the comments when I was going through uh, the comments in my video. So thank you very much, whoever mentioned it. I can't remember who it was, but that's the soap I'm going to use today. Anyway, on with the shave. Uh, the razor is the Executive Shaving Claymore Single Edge Razor. Lovely, lovely razor. Yeah, uh, it's a three piece, all stainless steel, 316L. Very nicely made. Yeah, there it is there. Beautiful. And it has on the nice chunky handle on the bottom, it's, it has executive shaving. Yeah, you can get this in the Alpha one as well. Alpha, it, it's the same razor. Um, it was a kind of collaboration between the both, but Alpha sell them worldwide. Executive shaving sell them in uh, Europe and the UK. And a company in Scotland, executive shaving, from Glasgow, um, and the guy that runs things there, I say run things, uh, Brian Mulraney. Brian's actually a guy, he's from, originally from Dundee, which is my hometown, city, hometown, home city, uh, and Brian runs things at Executive Shaving, but not anymore, he's just retired. Um, I think it was last week, or very recently he just retired. I've seen a post on Facebook, so best wishes, Brian. Um, here's to a long, healthy, happy retirement for you. I uh, hope you enjoy it and I hope you're keeping busy. Right, on to the razor, executive shaving Claymore. The blade I'm going to be putting in that is a feather professional blade. So here they are here, uh, brand new. These are from Japan. I'll just uh, get them open if I can get them open. <laughs> I maybe should have done this before we started, but I thought it'd be easy, you know, because there's a little strip there and I thought that'll just come away. And uh, yeah, but it's like everything else that I try and do, it's just, nothing's ever easy. There we go, way! Right, so there's the blades. Uh, you get 20 in this. I'll show you what it looks like. Uh, it comes like this in this little cartridge thing. Uh, and you can see that on the top there, it says uh, push and pull. So what you do is, you push it like that, pull it back, and then the blade's ready to go, so you just push, 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 and there's the blade, comes out, like that. So there's the blade. Yeah, you can see the edge of it at this side. So that goes onto the top of the razor like that. You can see that in those little posts. You can see the blade there? And that fits on like so. It's all very complicated. <laughs> I'm all in. Um, fingers and thumbs. Is that what they say? You're all fingers and thumbs, Kevy. So this goes on like that, and then it screws on. Like. Uh, if you weren't trying to hold up the camera, it'd be much quicker, <laughs> I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I was just going to say, it has Executive Shaving, the logo on the uh, underside there. Can you just see it here? Yeah, so there's the blade inserted there. Does that look even? Yep, looks good. Right, let me just put the blades out of the way. So the soap that someone mentioned was this from Austria, Hasslinger. And this is Honig, or Honey. Um, it's this, this is the old version. Uh, there's the ingredients there. If you want to pause that, take a look. Uh, yeah, this is the tallow version. I think they've changed it now. 
it's a, it's a vegan soap now. They've taken the tallow out, so here it is. They come in these little plastic pots wrapped in cellophane, so I'll just take that out of there. Very cheap soap, but absolutely wonderful, wonderful performing soap. Honey, yes, really, really nice. There it is there. I'm going to use it like a, a shave stick and just rub it on the bristles like that. Uh, the brush, the Simpsons Trafalgar T3 with the Sovereign Fibers synthetic brush. Thought I'd use that. Right, so that's uh, that's the gear we're using. How long's that have been? Half an hour, right? I'll see you next time. <laughs> no, no. These videos are as long as they've got to be, right? We like to chat and we like to talk and we like to get to know each other and share things and, you know. Right, let's uh, wet these whiskers. Look at this. I look like a right scruff. A right scruff. Yeah, badly need a shave. Right, so I'm just taking this puck. You can do it any way you want. Yeah, it's a, it's a quite a light honey scent, but it's very nice. I just think if you do it like this, it's probably easier, maybe not as messy. If we need to go back, we will. But I don't think we will, because I remember this soap. I've probably not used this soap for about three years. I'll just give it a quick rinse. There we go. Yeah, I can feel I can feel how slick that is. Very nice. So look at that. <laughs> what do you mean you think I've overdone it on the soap? Do mm, you think? Right, wet the brush. Give it a squeeze and let's go. Yeah, I don't see um, I don't see many people using. Uh, I've not seen anyone use it for a while. Hasslinger soaps, and they're very, very good value for money. As I say, I think they're. I think they're. I've not checked for a while, but they might be about under ten pound. Dip the whole brush in there. Mm. Yeah, so just working it into these bristles, quite long bristles. More water. More water. Just paint some in. Just take your time building your ladder. Start to look good. A little bit more. A little bit more. Yeah, the more water you add, and the nicer shine it gets on it, the, uh, the slicker the soap's going to be. Which is what you want, right? You want a nice slick soap. If it's too dry, it'll still work, but it won't be as slick. Look at that ladder. You're not going to argue with that, are you? Anyone? Yes, you've taken too long to build the ladder, Kevy. I'm sorry. Go make yourself a sandwich. <laughs> Come back, I'll still be here. <laughs> I just like playing with it. The 
lather. Right, that looks good. Yeah, look at that. See the shine on that? Looks good, looks good. A nice green cone. Right, so get some heat in this. I'll get cleaned up a little bit here. Right. Executive shaving claymore with feather. Professional. Professional. Right. That. Let's just wipe that out. <laughs> oh wow, that is slick. Easy to get under the nose. Yeah, nice uh, slim profile head. I've forgotten how slick that soap is. You know, I've, I think I've got a I've got a, a coconut puck as well of the uh, Haslinger, but I think it's the new formula. I can't remember if I tried it or not. This razor is so, so smooth. Um, great knurling on it, not going anywhere. No overhang to worry about. Yeah, I think, um, I've never used a feather professional on this. I usually use the uh, Pro Guards. But there are different blades you can get for it. Um, but this one feels very nice. Yeah, that soap, wow. That's excellent, right. First pass done. Yeah. Oh, that feels like there's a film on my face. That is superb. Right, let me rinse and come back for the second pass. Okay, that's that rinsed off nicely. Yeah, really good slickness there. Man, I need the haircut. Um, yeah, right, okay, back to the brush. Look at my, <laughs> look how much ladders on that. I'm not shaving up there. Yeah, the good thing about these uh, synthetic brushes, they, they whip up the lather, release it, no problem. This is amazing. It's great to revisit old soaps that you've got. You forget how um, good they are. You know, there's no old singing, old dancing bells and whistles with this. It's a lightly scented honey soap that performs like a soap four or five times its price. Yeah, well, I hope um, Hassling are still making soaps actually. I've not, as I say, I've not seen or heard anything about them for a while. I know you, you can get them online and stuff like that, but um, yeah, I must check them out. See, uh, see if they're still about. I think they are. Right, on the second pass with the Claymore. I said I wasn't shaving up there, look, I just did. Yeah, it's an easy razor to find the angle.
it for quite intuitive. Even the cushion on the soap, I can feel it. If you don't have a Hasslinger soap, go out and buy one. Let's see what you think. You know, it's not going to break the bank, it's only, I think you'll probably get it for less than $10. But don't quote me on that. <laughs> but it's very cheap. I don't know if I like Amazon and stuff, do it? I don't know. Yeah, as I say, they change the formula on the soap. So, I think I've tried it, but I remember it being still good. Um, obviously, if, if tallow's not your thing, just check that, that there's none of that in the ingredients. You know, some, some uh, vendors might some have, still have old stock. But you still have the uh, tallow version, so if you're uh, if that's not your thing, yeah, just check. Yeah, I've seen on the news. Some of the temperatures in the world, like was it in India or Pakistan or someplace like that, 50 degrees Celsius, which is probably about 130, 130 degrees Fahrenheit. Just crazy, crazy. Oh, look at that weeper there. Yeah, and I'm moaning about this. Uh, it's, it's dull here. Yeah, I wouldn't want it to be that hot. Gee was you fry your boots. That temperature. Right, okay, let me rinse. I'll come back for the third pass. It feels great. Okay, that's that rinsed. Yeah, a little weeper there. Just, uh, let's get stuck. Not much left. <laughs> that's what these tools are for, so use them. Why not? Right, back to this brush. Yeah, it's a, it's a honey scented soap. That's what it is. That's all it is. But it's nice, pleasant, not strong. Plenty of lather there. Plenty, plenty, right. Third pass with the Claymore against the growth. No pressure on the razor, just let it do its thing. Just let the soap and the blade and the razor work together. smell the honey there. Yeah, we had um, nicer weather last week. Last weekend for the uh, Jubilee, the Platinum Jubilee. Uh, yeah, we had lovely weather. A 
We had three whole days of sunshine. Three days of sunshine, Scotland, come on. You're getting a bit greedy with the sunshine, aren't you? Three days. <laughs> yeah, that's it. <laughs> that's our summer done now. Three whole days of sunshine. <laughs> is lovely. Even though the camera's on and I'm talking to myself or to you guys but it feels like to myself I'm really enjoying this really relaxed. Just a nice evening shave. <sighs> right let's have a <laughs> well Let's have a quick rinse and feel about. Let's see if there's any pickups needing done. Ooh, I tell you what, the tiniest of bit just there, but no, <laughs> nowhere else. Let's just get that. Yeah, that's amazing. You had a, a, a good bit of growth there, so you always find when you've got a lot of growth, you always feel like you get a better shave, right? You always get a closer, comfier shave when your stubble's a little bit longer. Right, three passes, pickups, done. Let's uh, have a face wash with this. Yeah, look at that. Plenty soap there, plenty. Can you see the shine on that? I don't know if the light's catching it, maybe there we go. Right, let's have a face wash with this, whoa. So what I do is, I rub this in. It's left over the ladder. Rub this into my, my skin and then uh, I rinse it off with hot water and cold water and then I clean it on my gear and I'll come back for the post shave. See you soon. Oh yeah. Feels really good. Right, on to the post shave. Um, it's quite late at night here, well, it's about nine o'clock, so nothing too strong that will last. Uh, going with Old Spice, this is the USA version, in the kind of plasticky bottle. Good stuff, I've not used this for a while either. So, a little splash of that. Oh, a nice little bit of burn there. Yeah. Skin feels amazing, really good. And finishing it off with something I've not used for a long time, uh, Taconic Shave Aftershave Balm Unscented. Uh, this has aloe, calendula, sunflower oil, coconut oil, glycerin, sodium lactate, blah, 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 menthol and lime essential oil. There we go, there's the ingredients if you wanna take a look. Yeah, this is good stuff. I've not used um, anything from Taconic for quite a while, actually. Comes in a nice little pump. That should be enough, I think. Three little pumps. Yeah, more than enough. Yeah, no scent to this, so. Rubs in very easily, good stuff. Excellent. There we go. And there's the result. Nice, clean shave. Right, let me show you what I've used. Uh, the razor for today, Executive Shaving Claymore Single Edge. Fantastic. Inside that was a brand new uh, First Use Feather Professional. Yeah, very good, very comfortable razor to use. 
easy to find the angle, it's very smooth. Um, it's just good, I love it. Yeah, very, very good. Uh, the soap, Haslinger, Honig or Honey. Um, yeah, here's the puck here. I'll just let that dry out for a little while before putting it back in the cellophane, back in this. Yeah, um, if you don't have any Haslinger soap, go out and get some, if you can. If you can pick some up, they're not expensive and they just work very, very well. Um, as I say, this is the old tallow version, so I think they've changed it, so it's all vegan now, so um, if that's your thing, that's fine. Uh, the brush was the uh, Simpsons Trafalgar T3 with the Sovereign Bristles. Great little brush. Fantastic brush for the money as well. Yeah, not expensive, but very good. Three passes pickups. Used a little bit of uh, styptic on this thing down here. There's another little weeper there, creeping up. That's okay. Um, yeah, three passes pickups, face wash, post shave was, Old Spice, and finish the shave with Taconic Shave, After Shave Balm, Unscented. And that's the shave. Yeah. Superb. Really good. Ready for bed now. Is that another little weeper there? Don't think so. Anyway, hope you're having some good shaves. Um, yeah, enjoy the rest of this week and look forward to the weekend. I uh, hope the weather's better where you are than it is here. It's summer here, though. That's kind of expected in Scotland. <laughs> it's not as bad as I paint it to be. It's uh, we have we have some good summers. Um, not this year, but <laughs> I'm only kidding. Uh, thank you once again for all, for all your uh, comments and support watching these videos. I really appreciate it. It means a lot to me uh, to know that people are enjoying them and getting something out of them. I don't know what, but hey, it doesn't matter um, as long as we're all enjoying each other's shaves. Uh, sharing them and uh, yeah, on all the forums and Facebook and stuff like that. Right, okay, have yourselves a great, great weekend. Look after loved ones, stay safe, and I'll see you in the next video. Take care.